Alright, uh, this is Tony of Five Point Gamers with Dustin, Zach, and Alex. Uh, we're going to be playing through an old classic that some of you probably never heard of. It was pretty rare. Yeah. Uh, oh. That's a terrible pun. Oh my god, pun. Zach, shut up. No. Um, obviously, uh, Donkey Kong Country 1. The only one that I know about. I don't think they made any others that wasn't very popular. No, this is a pretty terrible game. Uh... I don't know, uh, Zach probably liked it. That's, oh, that's oh yeah. Uh, so, uh, we're gonna do the same thing with the Dish Island. We're gonna switch off every level. Uh, it's Dustin starting us off. This game is older than Yoke's Island was, so it probably won't be as good. Uh, uh we should... Doesn't matter which one I race. Uh, race... Well, just three. race three. Yeah, race three. Alright, so, so... Definitely have not beaten this game before. No, first time. Line for literally everybody, except for most people. You know what always bugged me about yeah. this? Is you can't go to the first level there. Mm -hmm. That always bothered me. That there's like little flowers are there, but you can't actually travel on them. Mm -hmm. So, first level, jungle hijinks. Not playing Yoshi Stone Island. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, look at the picture in the background. It's a boat. And there's oh, candy. 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 Yeah. The, the, the fish is moving in it. Wait, what? What? Oh my god! <laughs> <that's so cool. laughs> I never yeah, realized that. that. I just saw it too. Oh. That's... that's crazy. <laughs> Good for them. Yeah. All right. So, <laughs> and then you just re the door. Let's find out our story. Yeah. What? Oh, oh no. no! We're out of bananas! We have to go kill literally everything to get him back! Yes. This seems pretty accurate. Guess when you're a monkey, you go for bananas. Yep. Uh, I think there's a. Actually, he's there. a gorilla. Yeah, the shadow is uh, a separate. Oh, okay. Ooh. I don't remember what this is used for. You I can think ride it's it. finding a bonus. Yeah, I'll see. I Actually, I, don't, I, don't, I think this best person doesn't like doing it. Oh. Uh, I think sure I usually just ride it. And then I have to go back and get all the stuff that I so I'm riding it. <laughs> I want the balloon, but I don't think I can get it. So, I'm gonna do a quick run through of how the game works. Um, so that way, people watching us who've never heard of this break, this game would be like, ah, oh, okay. I want to say it. I don't actually know. Right, you're uh, two monkeys. Uh, you're <laughs> you're uh, like trying to uh, get to the end of every level, and at the end of every world, there are some there a boss. Um, what's whoops? Wow. wow. Um, first death. What's I'm interesting about this me. game, uh, and one thing I really like about it, is that uh, the monkeys have different abilities. The big uh, monkey, Wait, Donkey Kong, uh, is bigger, and he can do that, and he's better at killing uh, beefy guys. Uh, Diddy is uh, more spry, uh, but can't kill the beefy guys. How do you, how do you dash? You go in this game, you just want to do it. Oh. I'm used to DKC. Uh, not... I think I think that he's a little faster. I think so. Yeah. Uh, but they make that more notable in later games. Yeah. And uh, I think Diddy is a smaller hitbox, so he, it's harder for him to get hit by him. Okay. I think he can. I think he might be able to jump a little farther too with the cartwheel. Yeah. Yeah. Can Can Donkey even do a cartwheel jump? Well, he, yeah, he can yeah. do a roll. Okay. Some result. Uh, I used to be good at this. I think I need the ostrich. It doesn't. No, it's whichever one you want. Oh, I'm gonna get the ostrich. Uh, yes, yeah, so there's also uh, you can get animal rides in this game. Basically, they're like better Yoshi's. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's true. true. They they all have stuff that they can do. Oh, first bonus level. Oh, and if you get three uh, gold symbols on uh, a specific animal, uh, then you get to do one of these bonus levels where you keep kind of run through and grab all these things. Uh, I think if you get every hundred you get, uh, gets you extra life. Right. I think so. And if you want to shoot for about 600, uh, 500 for bonus level if you can. Well, at least we got two. Uh, what? Typically, uh, most bonus levels oh, have, like, a secret, uh, like, hidden room area, which, which has, like, a mega thing. Uh -huh. like, a, like a giant symbol that will double your current score. Mm -hmm. I don't know if this one does, though. Uh, yeah, I know the swordfish one does. Yeah, I know the swordfish one does. I know the, uh, the... Yeah, the, the frog with us. I don't remember this from ever having it like that. This is the one I got the most often again. The ostrich? Yeah. Yeah, same here, and I, I never really did too good at it. Alright. Right. So four and a half lives, not bad. Yeah. Not bad for a first go. Holy kidnap. 
<laughs> Half Life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll just bring back one monkey. <laughs> yeah, yeah he, so Jetty can't kill these guys by, by jumping. jumping. But he but can he car wheel their face. Right. <laughs> I personally prefer playing as Diddy just because he is a bit faster. Put him up there. Uh, yeah, he, he's just a bit faster and a little bit more. Uh, he's a bit more dexterous. So uh, I guess Zach is up next. Right. Hey, the game is hard. <laughs> well, I already died at the first level, so oh, like, Diddy can't deal with the armadillos. I have to switch out. He's uh, still left. Uh, but you have to move so you don't get hit. Um, uh, bananas in this game pretty much count. They, yeah. they count as coins, basically, for Mario. 100 bananas will get extra life. Um, if you find all four letters, that's called Kong, you'll get extra life. Uh, balloons will give you extra lives. It's pretty um, easy to get extra lives in this game, but it's like most Super Nintendo games where it won't save your lives if you turn off the system. Uh, there's a random Ram Ram so It'll save that uh, once you turn off the system. If you get two more, you'll get that special Ram book. Right. Uh, something else about this game, um, I don't remember quite the specifics for how they, they do the graphics, but it is extremely pretty. Pre-rendered. Pre Pre-rendered graphics. They, they pre That's the mid-barrel. Get those. Checkpoint, basically. Uh, yeah, Pre-rendered graphics. Uh, it has a fantastic musical score. Is there anything? Yeah. I can't see. Um, I just noticed that uh, all tech made it. Yeah, it's system, I mean, it's basically, I think it's one of the highlights of the platforming genre. It really is pretty... It, it does a lot of things. Uh, Yoshi's Island actually took a lot of stuff from... Well, I've ideas from... But... Whoops! I thought I grabbed that. Wow. You don't have to press a button to grab the ropes. I know, game. but I thought I would have grabbed it. Didn't let me grab it. You were close. Yeah. Uh, but a uh, notable thing is there there is no heads-up display in this game. There's, no th there's nothing that you see in front of you that keeps track of your score. Or how many bananas you have, it only pops up like when you need to see it. Uh, so the whole screen is devoted to just the game. Right. Which is nice. Wait, well. <laughs> wow. Just that? to be noted, this is. Yeah, I barely played this game at all in my entire life. So it'll be a good learning experience for him, because the rest of us, I think, are all pretty familiar with it. Yeah. Uh, even though I died at the first level, I have beaten this game. And that was kind of hilarious. I don't think I've actually beaten the third one. Third one... I don't, I don't remember which one is harder. Second or third one. <laughs> I think it, part of it depends on how much the optional stuff you do. Uh, the Lost Worlds. I feel, I, I, I feel like the, the third one... <laughs> what? The second one had the... Oh! <laughs> oh the wow. invisible invulnerability got you, didn't it? No, no, I, no he, he just... He, he was... Um, he didn't hit the, the grabby part of it. Uh, he, he just ran uh, through. You, he just or made a fail. Yeah, I would definitely say the second one has the most difficult, uh, the, the most levels that are difficult. Um, and, uh, the second one's the one I played the most, and mm -hmm. I played through it re relatively recently, and I actually found it much easier than this one. Yeah? For the most part. Well, this one's actually not that bad either, and I haven't played the third one recently, but I do, I remember having the most trouble with uh, the third one's levels. They had some of the levels, some of the levels in the third one, like the gravity level. Oh, the the third one had the gravity level, third one and, and the reverse controls. Reverse controls. Right, yeah. Uh, bobsled levels. Lag there. Wow. How do I get that G? Yeah, you can climb up that map. I can do this. Yeah. Right, yeah. It's like it didn't collect the live after you. Uh, you should get some advice. Cookie. Oh yeah, right. go to Crank. Anyways, uh, Alex is up next. All right, so the uh, old fart in the cabin uh, gives helpful advice but it comes at a great cost of self-esteem. Yes. So let's see what he has to say. Okay. You big ape. I can he, hear you coming from miles away. He has a rhinoceros. Games never looked like this when I was a lad. When you were a lad, games didn't it. exist. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, okay. Yeah, you don't have to press buttons. Ah, You'll just talk on I don't know why I'm telling you all this. You didn't. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Yeah. Oh, uh, Donkey Kong actually like he like covers his head and he has <laughs> and he doesn't even care. That you thought this was 64 bit. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's funny. Yeah, Diddy doesn't care. Like whatever. You're cutting through my head there. Yeah, four games. Wow, he's kind of mean. Yeah, I think he's well, even he, meaner he, in the second one. He's not gonna one. say anything helpful, is he? No. All right. Well, in later levels, he says helpful things. <laughs> wow, I did not know he talked that much about things. <laughs> 
technology. Yeah. Well, he he was maybe yes. there's an Easter egg that made it change because at, at the turn of the millennium that'd be really funny. <laughs> like the, the cartridge has a hidden clock in it. <laughs> what? To protect him from Y2K. So, so like <laughs> so like Nintendo put like uh like market like future marketing decisions. So all of a sudden you pull out this this thing and it's referencing the xbox <laughs> or not the xbox the uh we yeah it's like what how did what <laughs> I, I, they should also reference the 64 bit wraparound yeah <laughs> no all right so uh we got third level we got snakes in a cave <laughs> all right Definitely let's see yeah. if i can uh outperform where my colleagues failed and not die in the third oh third i get the water level, level. I just realized that. Oh, you poor baby. Uh, our levels in depth are kind of cool. Yeah. Uh, one thing we should mention... Woo! Uh, one thing we should mention is that the bosses in this game are really, really short. Mm -hmm. So we're kind of not counting them as stages. Uh, it's basically uh, whoever wants to do the boss, go ahead and does the boss. Well, it's not just that they're short. I mean, there is no level... Preceding the boss, they went on to a castle or a dungeon to get to it. And the boss is right. really easy in the first place. Uh, not, they're not always easy. Short. Yeah, they're yeah. generally short. Yep. They're the, bosses, the, rest of the bosses are definitely way better in you know, later DK games, though. Oh, yeah. Hey, you found a secret. Did you remember that was there? Nope. I'm just really good at doing stuff on accident. I believe tires. that's a good thing. I'm not entirely sure where the tires happened. You're on top there. of the, you're on top of the, the cave. Oh. Wait, you're not entirely oh. sure? Yeah, I'm not entirely uh, sure uh, what the tires have to do with them. Like, I don't know where they got that idea. They wanted a bouncy thing. The monkeys like tire swings, I guess? What did you do? Uh, yeah. He tried to duck, but he was able to hit him anyways. Because he was hit or something. Ah. He sees the world from a higher angle, he's supposed to be right. Oh, yeah, he, he probably has a pretty good perception. Uh, I did it! So as you can see, the levels are pretty short here. Um, I know there's a, there's a trick that you can do, I don't remember, like, when you're going, I think it's here, when you're going in between these areas, like, you press a button or something, and it'll teleport you to, like, World 3. Huh, what? Yeah, I think it's either right between these two, or between this one and Funky. Huh. Um, I'm not gonna do it right now, because I don't wanna go to World 3. Right. But, uh, we'll, we'll look it up later, and we might do, like, a quick video on that, if we can okay. work. Is that intentional? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That would be a really weird glitch. Yeah. But I I found one by accident. For how? Hey, those uh, those bass are in the uh, third game, aren't they? I don't think that's they're... like one of the few enemies they kept. I don't think I don't think it looks the same. They actually look kind of delicious. They actually look like actual fish. Yeah. Which is kind of a thing. Yeah, and these look like actual monkeys. That's not what octopus do. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure that's what real octopi does. That's a croctopus, actually. A croctopus? Yeah. Alright, because... The world won for, li for a life grinding. <laughs> Alright. Did he swim so... Did he swim so silly? He does, like, a dog paddle kind of thing? Yeah. Alright, so this is Endguard. Uh, this is one of the main reasons why the water levels kick ass in Nocturnal games. Because you're a swordfish. Apparently swordfish are at the top of the <laughs> Always. And that's not even the food chain. I think they're just at the top of killing everything. They don't even eat them. They're just kind of like, oh, you're dead now. Sorry, what's they're that? like the trolls of the sea. Not going to get that one up? I didn't get it. Okay. In the second game, all of the animals kind of get upgraded. Like, they generally have a second thing that they can do. Uh, for example, Ungard. Ungard and uh, Rambi. Rambi both have a similar kind of charge. Yeah, they, they both charge. And, uh, if you do that charge, you can usually plow through, like, a secret area. Huh! What? What? <laughs> These twins! Well, now, now Donkey Kong can get one. Yeah, Donkey Kong is like, no, I'm in the floor right now, I'm good. <laughs> Maybe that's why they're always part of a team, because the other one's invincible. Oh, what's that? Shark... thing? Dead now. now There's an ostrich dead. in the sea. Oh yeah, oh yeah, it's, where else? An ostrich. That's a good point, we're... Exactly. Okay. What? Yeah. Wait, I think that was a compliment. 
Um, I <laughs> Oscar just has skinny neck. Uh, true. And they're, always, they're always hiding. Anyways, where are oh! we? Oh! Wow. wow. Uh, uh, speaking of, really quick, something I didn't realize until relatively recently, is that it is possible if you kill enough enemies in a row to get an extra life that way. But since there's no score system, it's really difficult to tell. Yeah, I've done that. I think if you, like, kill five alligators, it's one. Yeah. 